We have been learning about seeds and seed dispersal. Plants need to disperse their seeds away from themselves to stop overcrowding and to create new colonies. Nearly all seeds are reproduced within fruits. These fruits enable the seeds to be dispersed in a variety of ways. We made our own models of seeds that demonstrate each method of dispersal. The ways of dispersal are wind. Some such seeds are adapted to catch the wind and are blown away. One such seed is the sycamore tree that produces a seed that is carried by a pod that looks like a helicopter. My model shows wind dispersal. The feathers help the seed fly through the air and land safely. We're glowing. This model shows wind dispersal. This is the model of a helicopter carrying one seat. This is an example of wind dispersal. Some seeds are waterproof and can float, just like the coconut. Explosional bursting. These seeds suddenly burst open, throwing their seeds in all directions over a large area. Peas disperse in this method. Our model of seed dispersion demonstrated explosion. We called we called our seed the flower blaster. We called it the flower blaster because it shooted, it looked like a flower and it shooted out seeds like a person throwing a dart. <laughs> this is our seed. <laughs> this model is an example of dispersal by explosion. As we blow through the straw, the air forces it up and it shoots up into the air. Ooh. My model is demonstrating dispersal by exploding. This is a glitter flower seed pod and this is how it works. This model is demonstrated by explosion, and this is how it works. You pour little seeds into this tube, and it goes down and lands into this balloon. Then, you pull the balloon by its tip, and then you let it go, and then the shoot, and then the seeds come shooting out. This model shows seed dispersal through explosion. The air pressure forces the seed out of its pod. Come <laughs> on. This model is dispersed by when the balloon pops the seed spread. This is the Velcro and it, and it attaches and it has hooks. This is the hedgehog and it attaches and it has spikes. This is the spike and it has spikes and it attaches the wool and stuff. And this one works the best. <laughs> Drop and roll. The casings of the fruits from these seeds or plants split when they hit the ground and the, and the seeds roll away from the tree or host plant. This model is an example of the drop and roll dispersion method. Here is our working method. 
when the pod is dropped, the seeds roll away. When the pod drops, the seeds roll out. Some seed pods, when dried in the sun, have little holes in them, like a pepper shaker. They shake when it's windy, and the small seeds are thrown out of the sh shaker through the holes. This model shows the shake shaker method. My model is an example of dispersal by shaking. When the wind shakes the pod, the seeds fly out in the... In are blowing away. Here is how it works. Did you see the seeds? My model of seed dispersion is a shaker. The name of my seed is a pepper shaker. It works like a pepper shaker. The pepper shaker, the seeds are shaken out by the wind and blowing away. The last method of dispersal is by animals that eat the seed and then poop it out. The seeds are nicely wrapped in fertiliser, ready to grow. To make our models, we had to closely observe the features of seed and how they dispersed. We tried to replicate it with everyday materials. <laughs>